And the first way I'm going to mention is probably the best way in the case if you want to actually go ahead and preserve as much data as possible. And the reason for this is pretty much because, you know, you, when you restart your device, when you go ahead and reset it, you don't want to go ahead and delete everything off it. So the very first thing that I would recommend pretty much everyone to do is to actually go ahead and let your phone just be stuck on the Apple logo for about five minutes, 10 minutes, 20 minutes at times. And sometimes, you know, in my experience, a lot of people don't talk about this, but it just takes a long time for your iPhone to actually boot up, especially if you went and just updated your device for some reason. I don't know why after rebooting and after reinstalling a bunch of software on my devices, especially when I went and jailbroke my devices and just, you know, on jailbroke them or whatever, it would take so long for them to reboot back into their software. I don't know why, especially with things like the iPhone 8s, the iPhone 6s, those type of phones, the older ones, they just take so long to boot back into the software. So if that's the case, just let them, you know, kind of sit out for even an hour at times, just leave it plugged in. And eventually, maybe if you're lucky, it'll actually go ahead and boot back into the software. Now it's I would say it's about, you know, very rare, but almost every single time that I let my phone just kind of like be stuck on the Apple logo and boot back up, it would almost fix it all the time. My data is still there. Everything's still there. So if you're one of those people who want to maintain their data and everything inside their device, your best bet is to actually probably just let your phone sit out and just wait till it boots back up or even use this specific method. Click the up volume button, click the volume down button, and then hold down the side button and then basically just restart the phone that way. Don't hold down the buttons. Just click the up button, click the volume down button, and then hold that side key and wait until your phone restarts. And this may actually end up rebooting yourself back into the software as well. Now, again, these two methods that I just listed are if you want to preserve the data. 